Yo, what's up, guys? Welcome back to the Black Ops 6 beta. Today, we are playing the Face Off playlist. So, this is actually the last full day of the beta being here. So, I'm recording two videos today. That's why you'll see me in the next video of Black Ops 6 wearing the same shirt. You get that out of the way. Anyway, today we are playing the Face Off playlist. These are small maps. There's only two maps Gala and Pit. Pit's a ton of fun. I've played Gala once, so I don't have too much experience with it. It seems like a pretty good map. Um, but these are small maps, so these have no score streaks, no nothing. And I'm actually liking that, because I feel like it's going to be good for camo grinding, especially for knives and pistols and shotguns. But anyway, that's what we're doing here in today's video. Let's get into it. Alright, so this is Gala. I actually like the look of this map. I actually really do enjoy this map, the look of it. <laughs> I killed with a grenade. I guess how many bullets are going to take? I feel like I... I have a challenge for using shotgun, that's why I'm using, but man, Black Ops 6, these face-off maps, I like, they brought it back, you know, these used to be in Modern and Cold War, they were first in Modern Warfare 3 2011, um, as part of the Call of Duty Elite Pass, like, when that was, you know, you guys remember Call of Duty Elite? Ooh. But man, these face-off playlists are a ton of fun, I like the idea of small maps, no kill streaks, no nothing. I'd be fine if you could earn UAVs or like the pulse, the scout pulse, like counter UAVs. I'd be okay with those. I get why you can't, because you can't shoot them down. But I think scout pulse wouldn't be a bad one, just because then you, everybody could have a UAV constantly going, pretty much. But I get why they are not. They weren't in Cold War either. They were in Modern Warfare 3, the original, but they are not in Cold War's Face Off playlist. Which I'm glad they brought this back. This is something I did enjoy playing because they were essentially the gunfight maps, but not gunfight mode which please try or bring that into the game i would love to play that got him, got him too bro this shotgun's so much fun to use though I like the w1200 from cod 4 but better i love it but man i will say i do enjoy small maps in call of duty like i don't i can't play these gaps every single day like i don't enjoy pure small map chaos it's why i don't play nuketown 24 7 why I don't play Shimmy 24 7 outside of maybe double XP weekends or every once in a while I'll play it because I don't enjoy playing just small maps because I feel like if that's all I'm playing I'm not gonna you know you're if that's all people play or just small maps why not just make a at that point why not just make a Call of Duty game with one singular map that everybody can play right that everybody likes obviously if they make multiple maps for you know people to not be bored or you know to enjoy the game but i feel like those who play just one map i can't i can't get behind playing can't enjoy playing one map over and over again that's why i don't play the 24 7 maps but i do enjoy having the face off playlist because it's a bunch of small maps they're all relatively usually pretty distinct from one another that are all relatively distinct from one another without being you know all you know the same or they're all distinct without being too different in how they are function, right? They're all small, they're all quick three lane map shipment hybrids, as I like to call them, but they're just fun to play. Ah, oh, Pit, bro. I like this map a lot. It's super cool. I wasn't, I actually wasn't expecting this to be a, this kind of map. I was originally expecting this map to be completely different. I was originally expecting this map to be a part of the um, derelict map, like under derelict. I imagined having a little under section, like under some of the trains or something. I uh, got him still. I didn't think I would there. But man, these smaller maps, I do enjoy playing. But I, I, I can't play these games all day, these maps all day long. I, I genuinely cannot. No matter how much I'd like to, there's genuinely no way for me to do so. Because I just get bored too fast with these maps, man. They're too small. They're too chaotic half the time. Which, sometimes the chaos is absolutely a, a blast. Don't get me wrong. I like the chaos sometimes. But I will say, I do genuinely enjoy playing... You know this playlist at least in the beta for right now i don't think i could play it you know i might not play it too much when the game actually fully release but i but i do genuinely enjoy it here in the beta for right now which makes me kind of interested to see will these maps be in the base rotation of maps or will they stay in the face-off personally i hope they stay in a face-off playlist and you know they add more maps over time But I do genuinely enjoy this playlist um, for what it is. I couldn't like it can't play it all day long, but I do enjoy it. However, I will say this. It is pure chaos for leveling up weapons that I haven't used a whole lot in the beta, like that shotgun. I haven't used a whole lot. I ranked up the, a the AK-74 in this. 
Even the Jackal I've used a little bit. As you can see, I'm using the MP5 here right now. Or C9, whatever the hell you want to call it. It's an MP5 with an ugly front sight, but it's an MP5. But I've enjoyed, but I've enjoyed ranking up weapons that I haven't used a whole lot throughout the beta so far in this playlist alone. It's a fun playlist. I genuinely, I like this playlist. I'm not going to lie. I, I've been enjoying it a little bit. But with today being the last full day of the Black Ops 6 beta, if you guys have played it and or watched anything, what do you guys think of it so far? Are you guys, if you played it, are you guys enjoying the beta so far? Are you not? Are you still mixed on it? Have you, you know, if you played it, do you enjoy the movement system? Are you still kind of getting used to it? For me, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not saying I'm not used to it, used to it, but I'm, I'm definitely better off than I was when my first video I uploaded on this game. I love the being able to slide in any direction. It's so nice, dude. I'm so bad, much better used to the movement. It ruins me that it's gonna kill me when I have to go back to play Modern Warfare 3, man. Which, I have a few video ideas on Modern Warfare 3 that we got coming up soon, man. I'm really excited for those. That was a nice little dive on my part. I like the C9 a lot, man. Ooh, nice little double kill. I'm vibing out. I, I enjoyed this map more than Gala. 100%, dude. This map is so much better. Treyarch, please give us a 24-7 playlist of this map only later on. On Double XP weekends. Like, this in Nuketown, I could grind the absolute crap out of, dude. Speaking of, didn't they end that? Like, isn't Nuketown, like, in the launch map list? But they say 16 all brand new maps. But I think in COD, in the, in the, uh, COD Direct, you can see Nuketown shown. I think that was actually shown there, which... Hopefully it's, I wouldn't mind, I wouldn't care if it's their day one. I would be fine if it's their season one. Or if they did like they did with Cold War where they add it two weeks after launch. Which, I will say this, if Call of Duty swapped from just seasonal drops to, hey, you know, they lose season and then three weeks after the season launch or like four weeks, like a month in, they add another map and then another one. I'd be more than okay with that. Triple! I'm having a good time right now, Earl. I'm having a good day. I'm having a great... It's a great day right now, man. This game is so much fun, dude. I can't sprint. This, I, this is controversial. Can we get rid of tax sprint out of this game, please? I would do... I would pay money to get rid of it. I don't enjoy the tax sprint in this game at all. It messes up the Omni movement system, in my opinion, so much. Like, the game already is pretty... You already move relatively fast. I stuck him. I actually stuck some at the grenade. I'll take it. I'm so ready for this game's launch, dude. This game is amazing. Ah, uh, the amount of grenade kills I get in this game, bro. It's like it's like every beta. I always get a lot of freaking grenade kills, dude. I this game mode is pure chaos, and I am absolutely here for it.